Okay, I would like to get you started with SAP assignment 1. Okay, this assignment is on NetFever uh, Enterprise Portal. So, first of all, you have to make sure that you have the SAP logon on your desktop. SAP logon on your desktop appears once you have installed the SAP client. If you do not have SAP client installed, you need to take a CD from room 214 in the business building. Okay? It can also be mailed to you, but please make sure that you have um, the SAP, log, SAP client installed in your computer. Please contact Lee Siemens in room 214. Galway building, Galway business building and her phone number is 409-880-7220 if you do not have the client installed in your computer. So once you have the client installed in your computer, you double click on that, you go to new item and then click on next, you put in the server description which I have given in the assignment as portal 2 NetFever. Okay, so you put in portal 2 uh, NetWeaver and I believe the version is 7.0 and then you come back and then the application server is uh, portal to uh, cobcsuchico.edu basically the server is in California State University Chico we are using it from here so number is 49 and ID is PRT then you click on next you click on next and then you finish and once you finish that you will see portal 2 NetFever 7.0 under your system. Now you log on to the system. Your client number is 001. Okay. And I am using LU001 as my login ID you have your own login ID in Blackboard. Okay, So if you are in 3395, you get into 3395 and you get into um, your content and you see SAP access from here and you will see the login information from here. Okay, So put in your login ID. The initial password is uh, 123456. Okay, so once you say log, once you uh, lo enter, this is your enter. It will ask you to change your password. Okay, so change your password and write down the new password somewhere. Okay, uh, let me see. Uh, client number is LU. 001 right 001 001 I'm um, sorry uh, client client is 001 yeah so I should be okay Okay, let me try a new ID then. Okay, let me try LU050. I have to remember that I have used LU050 and I don't think I have given it to anybody else. Okay, so I do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and I'm here. Okay, so it is asking me for a new password now. So I put in my new password. And remember, do not forget it, write it down somewhere. I enter, I enter, enter, I'm done. So I can now log out of the system. Log off of the system. Okay. Now what I have to do is I have to get into this URL. So I copy that URL from my assignment. I get into Internet Explorer. It doesn't work well in Firefox so uh, use Internet Explorer 8 I get into here paste and then I log in so I use my ID and my changed password okay so I get changed my password 
Okay, here I, I just want you to notice the header, all these uh, different icons, the different tabs you can click and see what is there inside all of these tabs and then you need to go to personalize. So click on personalize, you need to choose a theme from here. You can choose streamline or you can choose chrome, anything that you would like to. I am choosing SAP high contrast, okay, and then I save it. Then I need to go to user profile. Here, you need to modify your information. So I need to modify and then there is a way it is asking you to change password. Uh, I keep my old password so I am not changing it and I am seeing how it works. Okay, And I put my email address. I put my physical address and uh, English uh, okay fine and then I need to save my work so I save it then this is my first screenshot so I click on I press print screen and then I paste it in a word document okay so this is my first screenshot if I want my screenshot to be uh, more clear I can do one thing I can go to all programs accessories I can go to paint and I can paste my screenshot here and I can put a you know I can have a better view so I can just copy this I mean crop this and I can cut it and I can go back to my document remove this and I can paste my better screenshot so next number two I need to go to contact information and I modify that information. So telephone number 409-880-8627, fax number 409-880-8235, mobile number I am making it up 409-999-9999, okay street I use my office address, city is Beaumont state is Texas, zip is 77710, country is US, and time is central time, okay, central standard time. So after that, I save my work, I use print screen, same thing I'll do, I will go to paint, I will open a new and I will paste it over here. I will use this and I will cut it and I will paste in my Word document to get a better view. This is my second screenshot. Third is additional information. So I click on additional information. I modify. I, my organizational unit is Lamar University. My position is I chair the department and also I am a professor of MIS and my department is information systems and analysis. I save it. I take a print screen. Uh, same thing I go to pay I go to paint, open a new file and I paste it over here and I do crop and then I cut it and then I paste it in my word document. This is my third screenshot. Okay. Now my fourth one which is a very important one. All of you be careful. Here if you click on here or here next item you will see I need to see that. Yeah. Keep pressing the next item till you see user mapping for system access. Okay. So keep pressing. So if you go this way, you will see general information, contact information, additional information. Click on next item. It's not showing another time. Then it shows. Okay. You have to go to user mapping for system access. Modify. 
okay once you do modify the system that we need to choose for this is OXF CLNT 105 this is our system okay now mapped user ID and mapped password your user ID will be your regular user ID for me I am using LU050 and mapped password put in the same password as you have uh, changed your original password of 1234562 is it so let me check what is there any note here because these password things can really mess up your work okay see mapped password enter the same password you just set for the portal logon okay so enter the same password you set for the portal logon so it's the same as your portal logon password so So what I do is I come back here and where is my thingy okay I use the same password and I save now I need to take a print screen which is showing my system it has to show my system to be OXFL FCLNT okay now I go back to paint I open a new file and I paste my thing here then I put a crop around it and I cut it and I paste it in my word document okay so now you go back to your assignment and see what was needed of you to submit you were asked to submit four screenshots general information contact information additional information and user mapping the screenshot must show your system so I'm here it's uh, my first one my second one is contact my third one is additional my fourth one is user mapping which shows my OXFCLNT system I save it so this is my assignment one okay this is your okay so now you submit it via uh, blackboard okay so this is my SAP assignment okay hope you have a good time working on this assignment